Creating breathtaking site design can be a really hard thing to do for some people. This is especially true for beginners who just started learning the web lingo. This is a good time to use templates. And in this screencast, we're going to talk about pre-made web templates. There are generally two types of templates. First one is paid templates. The second type is free templates. So I'm going to show you a site that sells uh, paid templates and then some websites that allows you to download free templates. Let's look at the paid one first. The first one I'm going to show you is coolhomepages.com. They have a template section where you can browse through all their templates. And as you can see here, uh, the prices average about $40 a piece and some may go up to 60. However, you do have the right to buy off the template to buy the exclusive right for the template, which will cost more. And the second site is templatemonster.com. Oops. Okay. templatemonster.com and it also allows you to buy website templates, flash templates, e-commerce templates and they're all sorted in different categories and you can search through them. As you can see here the templates on this site cost 66, 120 so it, it varies. It depends on how I guess how well the site is designed. So these are the pay templates. Let me show you the free templates. So you see here, these are all free templates that you can download and use for free. However, uh, there are agreements uh, for you to link back to this site. Usually that's what uh, the free template websites demand. Here's another one. Here's another one, free CSS templates. You can see list of templates. Here's another one. Here's another one, open design. Here's open source templates. Here's openwebdesign.org. Okay. So these are the free templates. All you need to do is visit the site. It'll gives you, give you instructions to download the files. And I'm going to show you what you get from a pay template and a free template. In my planning dot, uh, folder, I have a free folder and a pay folder. Let's look at the free one first. So in a free template, you get a text file that basically tells you the term of usage, an example of the index page, a CSS style sheet rules, and a folder with all the images. It's all cut up for you and uh, optimized for web use. And let's just look at this index page. So it looks something like this, where it's all laid out for you. And it's just an example of one page. So you will have to build the rest of the pages by yourself using the same theme. And uh, you will have to change the content area as well. Then let's look at the paid templates. Uh, you get the index page, but you also get screenshots of the site. And also examples of the pages. Okay, 
So you get HTML pages, numerous ones, and you get the example site with all the pages and style sheets and images. Okay, you get a lot of images. Not like the free templates where you just get a few. But also you get all the sources, which is the Photoshop files. With these files, you're uh, given the ability to change layers, change colors of the images, and republish the image as a new one so uh, your site can look very different. And it gives you the power to make changes to your site. So that's the difference between a pay template and a free template. And it's basically up to your decision to buy a paid template or just use a free template and then make the other images by yourself. So that's it for this screencast. Thank you.